Good morning, everybody. It is Monday, the, I don't know, 25th or something? Yeah, 25th of September. In the month, going fast. Last week, I've got to message my mechanic soon about doing my MOT. Um, he said he'd have it this week, so. Uh, Jennifer's in school. Paul's still not feeling 100% after his friend dying, so he's having a rest. He hasn't been sleeping, so fair enough. I'm just editing together last week's weekly vlog, and hopefully it won't take as long as my current chat did, which took like two and a half days. And I'm about to go up the shed to pack all the orders I had this weekend. So do you want to join me? Because it was a good weekend for me. I'll see you in a bit up there. Here we are again at the shed. It's not really as messy as it looks. It's just I sit on the floor to pack stuff because uh, it's too wet out here. I've been cobwebs everywhere. <laughs> There's lots of spiders around. It's that time of year, unfortunately. Um, but I'm going to crack on and see what's sold as usual i'm forgetting to show you what i've sold the first thing i packed were two sealed marks and spencer's shirts that one lady bought for her son for christmas um that were pulls that he never wore the next one is a pair of sequined matalan trousers so they only went really cheap because they are matalan like four quid but it gets them out of the warehouse well the warehouse out of the shed gives me room for other stuff so let's get this one packed up sold this game a ninja gaiden sigma for six quid it's been hanging around for a while it was in a bundle of stuff i had from somewhere probably from one of the auctions i expect got it from somewhere anyway yeah six quid i'm not gonna knock it you know it's better than nothing sold this camera it's going abroad gsp i don't know where i haven't looked yet it was a really bizarre camera it's rico though it's a good brand and it's got the original instructions, which is always handy. Now, this does work. I have run film through it, so we should be all good with that one. I am so hot. Oh, God. I bought these two shirts. Again, these are like the first two I sold. The other ones were the luxury ones, though. So, well, one was a luxury one, but this one as well. Very nice. Last two items going to different sellers, but I thought I'd just show you them quickly. Another M&S shirt and a Star Wars wallet picked up at a car boot sale I love a car boot this is a bag of some of my old clothes I've had for a while got this I love this t-shirt but it was small on me when I first bought it it's a Wizard of Oz one it's in absolutely pristine condition I don't think I ever worn it so I'm going to put that on and there's a load of Guinness stuff including this very rare Guinness Storehouse Staff T-shirt. Never worked there, got given one when I went. So, and it's a ladies 16 to 18. So, I could keep it, but I'd rather get money. <laughs> I'm going to crack on. See you in a bit. It's warm up here because um, I wasn't with the fan on, but then I remembered my mum and dad's sockets aren't working up here and they've got their heat in, so there's something wrong. So they live in a council house. I use it for photographing just because I haven't got space in my house at the moment, so um, they let me do it here. I'm absolutely sweating. Uh, but luckily the council electrician's coming out tonight to have a look at it. So, But I just had a couple of minutes. My dad just bought me up a nice fresh cup of tea, which is really lovely of him. Everybody is being so nice and supportive of me trying to do this. Now my battery's going on here, so I'm going to go down for lunch soon. And I think there should be a cable down there I can use to charge it up on, so I will charge it up then. But I'll see you later anyway. Back home now with Jennifer. We're watching Doctor Who. We're watching the series with Catherine Tate because she seems because she thinks she's funny. Uh, we're on the Santaran one with the Atmos gas thing. I've had a shower because it's really hot. It's much better. That'll do it. And yeah, I'm having a bit of a colour and see what's going on. It's really tired today. It's going to be pizzas for tea. Good morning. It is Tuesday and I'm about to go to town. I have measured all the stuff I photographed yesterday, so you saw that, so I'm not going to show you again. It's up in the shed. I just haven't put it away yet. I'm going to put it away later. And tomorrow I'll be drafting it all, getting it ready to go live. Um, 
I had two sales yesterday, so they're packed, ready to go. We put them in the car, leave them in the car while I'm out having a look around the town. So we're going to go into to Newport, have a look around the charity shops, see if there's anything worth picking out, like for a quid or two, and then come home, um, pick up Jen, drop parcel off, etc, etc. Tomorrow I will be going to my mum's after I've done the drafting. So that's the plan for today. I will see you in Newport. Good morning. It's Wednesday. Yes, I don't know what happened yesterday. We went into Newport. I went into Newport. The shop I wanted to go into was closed for refurbishment. It's back open next week, so we'll try again next week. I did go into Scope and buy 12 items. They're a pound each, so that's like 12 quid spent. I mean, they're not high end, but they're like Marks and Spencers and Necks and stuff like that. And, you know, there's some nice bits. And again, I'll be going to Mum's later to photograph them. So I'll show you what I've got, a bit of it while I'm, I'm there. Not all of it, but a bit of it. Because um, tonight Carl's coming to get my car so he can take it to be MOT'd. So tomorrow I won't be going anywhere other than walking Jen to school and picking her up from school. Uh, so the more I photograph today, the more I've got to do tomorrow and Friday because obviously I haven't got anything to do Friday. Hopefully I'll have my car back. Um, but one of the things I've got to do is I've got to update my accounts and stuff like that, so I might do that on Friday. Um, I might have an easy day of it, but I'm going to try and get as much done as I can photographing today. So I'm going to crack on with drafting and listing the stuff I photographed the other day when we were at Mum's. All the photographs are on, ready. So they're all basically there, and I've just got to fill in the details, so I'm going to go and do that now. And yeah, I did finish my book. The one about Tenerife. I loved it. It was really good. And I did get one book yesterday in Waterstones because I had, I have some money left on a gift card. Um, so I used that and I used some of my loyalty points from uh, Waterstones. So the book was actually free. And I got um, TJ Clunes Under the Whispering Door, which I've started. I'm really enjoying it. I started it after I finished uh, the other book last night. So <gasps> read that bit later. I am tired. <laughs> but I'm going to start and I'll see you later. Okay guys, I'm back up in the shed, got two orders to pack. That's stuff that's got to go away, I'm not going to do it now. I might do it uh, tomorrow, because I'll have more stuff to bring up then, so I'll do it all tomorrow. So, there's a the cat, lights on. It is grey and horrible, as you can see, look at the sky. We are expecting a big storm to come in today, called Storm Agnes. Oh, cats found something to play with. So that'll be fun. It's supposed to rain really hard later. So I'm going to get uh, my two items packed, which is those rolls of film there, sold for £21. I always put them on auction. It's good fun. I'll do another one next weekend. And then I've got a shirt in that one in the bottom to get out, to send off. So I'm going to get those ready. And then I'm going to head off to Mum's, do some more photography. Okay guys, hi, it's here, I'm here, I'm at Mum's doing the photos for the stuff I bought yesterday and some of the stuff I've got left over. I'm going to be doing as much as I can today because I won't have the car tomorrow. Um, so I won't be able to come up here tomorrow. So, you know when you have days and you just don't want to do something, today I don't want to do this. But I'm, I'm alright, I'll get into it and it's fine. Um, so it seems like you would like me to do Vlogmas. I know it's a long way off, but um, yeah. I will do Vlogmas. This is one of the tops I bought. I love this material. Um, these are all really good sizes. This is a 14. Um, it's quite nice. It's m &S. No, it's not. This one's actually Next. Next sells quite well. m and sells pretty good because they're good quality stuff. So I will pick up most brands. I do try and avoid things like Matalan, Peacock's. Primark. If I buy a bundle and it's in there, fine, I'll sell it. If it's something of mine, I'll sell it. But the supermarkets, again, yes, I tend to avoid. Um, although Nutmeg at Morrison's is very good, and obviously too, which is Sainsbury's, is a very good brand. They do some lovely clothes. Um, normally I'd get them in a bundle when I buy. Sometimes when I run out of stuff, I buy bundles off of eBay 
and I will be having a look for that because it just saves me going outsourcing. It does cost a little bit, but because you got the shipping as well, but it is what it is. I'm enjoying myself. I put, I've got two to go off today. They are ready. They are in the car because I'll be going straight from here to get Jennifer. But I am going to crack on. But yeah, so it seems like you want Vlogmas. So Vlogmas, we will see what we can do about that. Um, I don't know what we'll be doing. Um, but I'll try and show you whatever I can. So I'll see you in a bit. I'm going to crack on. Wednesday afternoon and I've done all my photographing. I did 20 of them. I, I've got a few still left to do. I needed a break. I've had a little bit of lunch. I'm going to have a snack now. So I'm still a bit peckish. Got myself some chilli heatwave Doritos and a packet of Nestle Crunch. Diet Coke. While I'm waiting to pick Jen up. <sighs> I'm knackered. Posted my two items. So I'm just going to mark them as dispatched on the system. And then that's it really. I'm gonna have a snack and read my book. And then get Jen. Go, I don't want to go for tea, I've got to get some out of the freezer. Maybe fish fingers and chips or something like that. And beans. That'll be alright. I'm gonna manage with that. I'm tired. And then tomorrow I have chicken curry or something, I think. Anyway. <clears throat> right, I'm gonna go. I'll read my book for a bit and I'll see you after. Good morning, it's Thursday the 28th of September. I do apologise, the vlog has gone out of the window this week. I don't know why. However, it is Thursday. I've just measured absolutely everything I've got that I can get drafted and I'm up in the office now going to do the drafting. Get some listings up. I've got two sales again to pack today. Um, I think my notifications for eBay aren't working again so I'm going to have to uninstall and reinstall the app again it's so annoying that this happens quite regularly because i only knew about the one sale then i logged in and i was doing stuff and i saw there was another one so yeah uh, i'm gonna crack on i'll see you in a bit okay i've finished drafting the stuff that was on the laptop i've now got to put the photographs from my phone onto ebay and i'm gonna do that in here and i put the tv on to watch some tv i've got the book as well so what i'll do is put in as much information as i can as i go apart from the delivery stuff probably and the measurements because do that slightly separately everything else i can do on the phone so <clears throat> i'll draft them all on the phone and then <sighs> first thing tomorrow i can go and finish them off or at some point tomorrow i can finish them off so the plan for today is to do that have lunch pack items pick up jen and drop the items in got to check my drop and go tomorrow is just finish these to get them ready for drafting into all the accounts, other admin stuff that doesn't get done every day, and then I'm going to order some more garment bags. I might do that now, and then I'm going to go up the shed and sort things out. So a load of filters, like Hoya filters and stuff. Um, so I'm going to look out for different lens mounts and put them into her. Um, what's it called bundles and see if we can get rid of them that way might be easier so anyway i'm gonna put the tv on i'm having a 10 minute break while i have something to eat and ring my mum and then i'm gonna crack on see you in a bit okay so i've had my lunch zed has just wandered into the shed i'm gonna put the two bags of items away i've got here and crack on with getting my items packed so i can take them down the road i've got to check my drop and go in a bit as well that's a mare in the shed Cats looking around saying, hmm, got this stuff to put away, just, it's quite nice actually out here, I mean it looks like it's going to rain, I'm going to show you now, I don't know if you can see it, but uh, it's very cloudy, it looks like it might rain, but uh, yeah, there's a bit of stuff to go in the shed, that was my hand, so I'm going to crack in and get this stuff away and get the new stuff out that I need to, um, package up and that's it, I'm gonna crack on. I'll see you in a bit. Hello everybody, it is Friday. I know the week the vlog's gone to pot this week. Hey ho. Anyway, um oh excuse me, my chest hurts. Uh, it's partly uh because my car all my weekend plans have gone out the window because my car needs some work doing on it for it to pass its MOT. So my mechanic's got it. So I'm waiting for him to let me know how much it's gonna cost to, to fix. It's a bit welded apparently. No idea. Shouldn't be too much, hopefully, a few hundred quid, probably. 
which isn't a lot when you haven't got a huge amount of money coming in, but we'll manage. So I've finished all the drafting from yesterday. That's all ready to go. Um, and I am now trying, I'm gonna do some photography in here, some rolls of film to put on auction. Um, and a few other things. If it's a nice weekend, I might suggest Paul we go for a few walks and I can take some of the cameras I'm trying to test because I'm trying to test about one. We've only got a few shots on it, so I'm not too worried about that. Not two, three, about three or four cameras I've got rolls of films in that I haven't finished yet. Some of them I'm testing and some of them are mine. I must get my Canon down. I've probably got a roll of film in that one as well. Yeah, I'm that bad. But there we go. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I do love my cameras. I will be, I will admit. Um, I today found some, uh, went through a load of filters and I'm thinking, should I sell them? Should I bundle them and sell them? And I might do. But there's a few ones in there that I could use on my film cameras. I thought, I want to give them a try. I might be able to use some of them on my uh, digital ones, but some of them are like, some of them I will be able to use on the digital ones, but some of them are, are like for, you know, there's an orange one and a blue one, which is like for, for black and white. So I could use those. Um, I, I, there's a couple I really want to test just for fun. So I might put them on my, uh, I don't have a Canon film camera. They are 58 millimeters. They are the Canon lens size, so. I'll have a look see what I've got upstairs, but Paul's having a meeting. I'm now going to go and do this photography. I'll show you what I'm going to photograph. And I'm also going to put some stuff up on our, uh, Instagram. But uh, let's go and have a look. Okay, that's a bit done, so that's not too bad. Now, if I don't get my car back soon over the weekend, what I might do is walk down to the charity shop the other end of Risca. Just have a quick look. Sometimes I get some good stuff. I'm not too worried. Um, if the weather's nice, I'll just go out for a few walks take a few cameras with me and, and test them. I've got three here I'm testing and we'll see what happens. I haven't had any sales lately, so I hate that. I hate it when there's, you know, there's no watches, no sales. It's just like eBay's turned me off. But I'm gonna get these few drafted ready and I can sort them out Monday or over the weekend. Monday I'll be putting, I'm putting three rolls of film up rather than five. 99p, see what happens, just for a change. I can then do a five next time. Hmm. Oh, it's the afternoon, I've picked up Jen, I photographed the stuff I wanted to. Done a bit of colouring. I can't find one of my books though, I was colouring in it last night, it was on the sofa this morning. And I moved it so Jen wouldn't sit on it, and now I can't find it. It'll turn up. Anyway, we're going up the pub later for a pint. We having a fish and chips and a pint? Probably that's the point. Tell him we're there, yeah. Wait, this time coming. Is Alex coming? <laughs> we're in the pub, aren't we, Jen? I don't think it's Alex. Oh, it's just... I'm saying they can. We'll have to go outside, though, because they'll want to be outside. Is that okay? Right, when they come, we'll go outside with them, but let's have our food in here first. That's Jennifer, she likes salt, it's not your Yes, food. she does, she does like salt. And then we've got some food here, fish and chips. What have you got? Steak pie and, and ale, pie and pie. chips. We have some chips, Jenny. Jen has got chips. Jen, put that phone down, eat your food, please. It's just... So I sat the evening, I've looked all day, saying that, we haven't done much. We went for a walk, didn't we? Yeah. Went to the park, played, had a drink in the club in the cricket club, well, they were open because they were playing football and they had a party on, so we had a couple of drinks. And we're back, and that was it. I hate not having my car. But uh, we'll be going out for a walk tomorrow, so hopefully I'll remember actually to take you tomorrow. So I do apologise, I'm just uh, a bit tired tonight. But uh, yeah, I've had two sales today, which is good. Hopefully I'll get a couple more over the weekend, but uh, we'll see what happens. It's Sunday morning. It's the 1st of October. We are headlong on the way to Christmas now. Oh, Jennifer's running around. Uh, Paul has gone shopping with his mum. She was very kindly um, come over from Newport to take him to the shops to get some food. And so me and her are inside watching Rebecca Zamolo. Come here, baby girl. You can say hello. <gasps> Hi, fans. You've still got my red pen in your hand? Yeah. 
So yeah, we're just chilling, colouring, aren't we? Drawing, doing maths. Yep, yeah, yeah, we show you that I work. Yeah, she's, she's making it up. She's asking me for the answers. Come on then. Here we go. There you go. Good girl. Right. Yeah, so it's Sunday. We're just going to have a nice chilly day. Um, I've got three sales to pack, so I'll do that a bit later. I've got the put the shopping away as well. But yeah, it's all good. So I'm just going to relax today. Okay, Sunday afternoon. Paul's downstairs with Jan. Done the shopping. It's all been put away. I just bought a lunch, and I am going to be tied up the bedroom a bit and watching Finder Seekers. History Beeper. Finders Beepers History Seekers. I, do you know what? I can't even speak today. Um, so, yeah, I want to do some filming tomorrow. Got my um, monthly thingy to put up. I wanted to do that today if I can, but I don't know if I'll be able to. I might try and do it later. And so on. Anyway, I'm going to crack on and I'll, uh, I'll see you in a bit. Hi, guys. It is Sunday night and it is now 20 to 10 at night. I'm going to wrap this up here. I'm still reading Under the Whispering Door, which I'm loving. I'm going to read a bit of that in a minute. I've just filmed my completed pages. So hopefully you will have seen that one before this one. Um, as I said in that, if you want to see a video of all my uncoloured books, because I've got a lot to encourage me to colour in them, let me know and I will make a video about all the uncoloured books I've got in my collection. There are a lot. I have a lot of books, I have a lot of books, I, and this is not the PDFs, I'm not going to do PDFs, it would take too long, but the physical books. But that's it for now, we will start this all again tomorrow. It's going to be an interesting week because I've still got no car, so it's going to be a lot of walking. That can only be good for my health. Not much else, but it'll be good for my health. I'll, uh, every time. I'll see you in the morning. I hope you've enjoyed this weekly vlog. Like I said, we have decided to do Vlogmas for Christmas, so you won't be getting a weekly vlog. Um, I will vlog right up to Christmas, including Christmas Day, and then we'll decide what to do for the rest of the month. I might just do like from the 26th, which is Boxing Day, my brother's birthday, to the end of the month, which is pretty much a week anyway, isn't it? You know, it's just, a, it's just not a full week I just I'll have a look at the dates and I'll make a decision but I'll see you all soon in the next weekly vlog bye bye